Other top story tonight laying the groundwork for Charlotte's growth. City Council members just passing the Unified Development Ordinance. This is the plan dictating how the Queen City will develop going forward. Among other measures, it revamps where homes and apartments can go. And WCNC Charlotte's Julia Kaufman shares what Council's decision means for your neighborhood. This vote was about seven years in the making. The UDO passed six to four, and while some council members applauded the plan for increasing housing and its affordability, others argued it does the exact opposite. What are we doing about our top priority, which is to protect or expand the stock of affordable housing? Councilman Edmund Driggs voted against the plan. It allows for multi-unit housing like duplexes in more neighborhoods by eliminating zoning for single family homes only. Driggs says he's already seeing petitions for multi-family buildings, but they come with a steeper price tag. He argues higher density doesn't equal affordability. It overcrowds our infrastructure, which we've also started to see. It's like a gold rush. Councilman Matt Newman thinks having more duplexes and triplexes will make neighborhoods more expensive because it may drive up property values using taxes. This uh, UDO, uh, which codifies the 2040 comprehensive plan, uh, will lead to gentrification in vulnerable areas within our city. Councilman Braxton Winston disagrees, saying the UDO simply gets rid of exclusionary zoning. When you replace one home with three or four homes, you get more housing. Uh, when you get more housing, you can supply more demand. Uh, when you better match supply with demand, you get more price stability. Several members tempered their vote of approval by saying the plan is a working document, meaning city council can make changes as needed before it's solidified. We have the time and the flexibility to continue to work on it. The UDO and its zoning changes will go into effect in June of next year. In Charlotte, Julia Kaufman, WCNC Charlotte.